I'm the uh, Parks and Rec Director for the City of Marathon here at Rotary Park, Children's Rotary Park. Uh, we started this process uh, back in uh, almost 22 years ago uh, when they had first built this, this park. It was uh, by Miss uh, Jane Daniel. She had the idea of creating this park for the children and she was a Rotarian. So at that time, uh, the, Rotary, the Rotary Group had put together the park and turned it over to the city. So now it's Children's Rotary Park. Uh, you know, 20 years ago when there was a wood structure, obviously over time and via hurricanes and other storms coming through, and just just time, it just tore, you know took its toll on the on the structure. Uh, when I took the position as the Parks and Rec Director three years ago, you know, looking at this, the the playground, I'm like, you know, we need to come up with something, you know, a little bit more up to date, and what we can do to make it a you know a safer environment for the kids and, and really open it up for the family. So, uh, talked to um, the city manager, who was Chuck Lindsay at the time, and the, our finance person, and we were able to get some, some money together via taxpayers dollars and, and basically start working on a, a new design for the playground. But it was one of those things where we came together, a great team of people in the Parks and Rec Department. Um, they all came out here, we used to have 13 days straight, you know, just working. And then we had different, you know, like I said, people in the community who helped us out tremendously. There's quite a, it's a, it's a long list of them. And to be honest with you, I don't want to listen because if I miss one, I don't, you know, I just want to make sure that. But it was a lot of people who actually made this thing happen. And, and now we're able to see the kids enjoying this playground. Beautiful park. I was here when they first built the first one. I live right down the street, so this is amazing. My kids are going to love this when they get here. Thanks to the city council and everybody paying their taxes so we could have this nice park. This is fantastic. This is great. I hope all of the children in Marathon and across the Keys get to enjoy this wonderful park that has been built for them. Guys, if you're not out here, you're missing out. I'm reverting back to my childhood days. I tell you what, the most beautiful park I've ever seen, and it all due to the hard work of the community. And we are so blessed to have so many people involved to make a wonderful playground. The Rotary, thank you so much, and all those that helped. Rhonda Redmond Lopez thanks you from the bottom of our heart, and it's a wonderful, beautiful place to bring some joy to all of our families. Come out and see it. It's really impressive. Thank you. I want to show everyone Sue's pavilion. I worked here for a couple of days, and I cut all the wood for the roof, and I helped install all the little bridges, and so this I will forever think of as my own very own pavilion. It's so exciting to have uh, the park finally open for the kids. Oh, well, it's a pleasure to be here at the Rotary Park, remembering when Miss Daniels recruited me 20 years ago to help build it to where we worked on it this summer. It's a great addition for the community and so I'm proud that the kids get to come out here and enjoy it. Thank you so much to the City of Marathon. What a great park. My kids have grown up attending parties and playing at this place and I have a lot of fond memories of this place so I'm glad that the community came together to just enhance this beautiful asset. So thanks again to the city and all of our sponsors. Just make this place a better place to live. We have a great crew away. They were here working on the park for a full week getting things going, getting things set up here and we're very very positive and very happy for Fire Rescue here in Marathon. They're community minded and as they say bad to the bone. You gotta love it. <laughs> Un Mike. Until next time.